Terry and Joseph Prophet. Okay, and I hope that there are people around. Please, please come, come to the back, come to the back. There's a lot of good stuff going on here. You might get more ice cream. No. <laughs> okay, so we are representing Connect Professional Life Coaching Services. But this, for this purpose, we are here on our Connections 50 Plus program. And really, Connection 50 Plus, and the reason you're saying 50 Plus, we focus on people, men and women, who are over 50. Of course, we do have programs for those who are under 50, but for this, we are looking at all those who are over 50 or who connected because it's connections. It's a symbolic age. <laughs> so those who connected, so all those who have your families, your mothers, your fathers, etc. We would really like this information also to be unique. So our topic is really on 50 plus entering into the third act. And you may wonder, what is the third act? What is it all about? And I will allow Terri-Ann to share that information. Okay, so you would have had many speakers talking about the situation in life, situation with women, things like that. But at Connect Life Coaching, we look at helping people through the journey of life. And we essentially say that life is made up in three sections. The first one goes up to about 30. Yeah. You're more or less guided by parents, teachers, people in your neighborhood, and so on. The second, which we call the second act, is really that time between 30 and let's say 50, 60. And at that time, a lot of your effort and energy goes into service of others. You are working to build a business. You are building your family. You are working in your community, in your church, and so on. But something happens around this 50 plus time. We realize, now, the other thing that happens in the second act is yeah, plenty status, huh? Yes. Because I am the manager of this. I am the I am this one's mother. I am this one's friend or whatever. But when you have to hit that 50 plus time and you have to come off that second act stage and step into this thing called the third act, you suddenly realize I am not what I have been doing and therefore what I am. And Jennifer, you know that's end up in yeah. what? The F word? And guess what happens? And I, many of you all here may be able to relate to it. Because when you know that you are 50, entering 50, and you wonder what's happening next? Am I going to be promoted? Am I, what is going on? Guess what steps in? That fear. You are fearful of so many different things. And so we want to talk here about what are maybe the three major fears that you would have happened, you know, that sort of emotion that occurs that really gets you, you know, in that state of mind. So let's talk about number one. And before anybody wants to just join and say what would be the biggest fear at that stage, what you're most worried about when you have to step off the second stage. Okay, it's an M word. <laughs> so the M word is money. Am I right? You with me? Pension. Yes. I uh, don't we have enough money. So in chatting with someone who passed by our boot, and they were saying, yeah, they're going to be retiring in about five years. And I asked, what are you doing now? What are your plans? And he said, all I'm doing right now is checking how much NIS I get in, what sort of um, pension scheme, what the lump sum will be. Because he Where is the paperwork? <laughs> Where rich? Where rich? Because their biggest concern is how much money am I going to have? And from there, then they want to move into, then what will I do? Because that's what's the biggest fear when they look at maybe that statement that's saying how much money you're getting. 
Thank you. How can I live on that? Because in most cases, your income is 50% you live on, right? And your lump sum is never enough. So money is a big fear, and we'll talk about how you can overcome that fear. What would you say? Let me go to the second one, the H word. <laughs> the H word. Guess what that is? <laughs> Are we right? Because what's the average age we live into now? Women are going to 90, men are going to 88. And you're walking up the second act stage at 50, 55, 60. So it's a good 30 years for the money to last and the body to last. So you're worried about health. And then we just have a one because we don't want to just talk. We want to forget, give you the solutions, especially those who enter it into that stage. But we have another age. Well, is there really an age and a C? <laughs> because even if you have the money, and even if you have the health, you realize that your life was so wrapped up in work and stuff. When you leave and you retire, resign, get fed up and walk out, you're leaving your crew. Yep. You're leaving your friends. Very often, a lot of people find Jennifer that when they come out of the workspace and they look around, they realize all my friends are work friends. It's work buddies. The last time they deal with themselves was probably when they leave school. So you see, what you're going to do now? <laughs> <laughs> Nobody left. You got up in the morning. You're not going to work. And you ask yourself, what would you do next? What is happening? Yeah, and the other issue, and, and this is a serious thing, because when you think of your community or your tribe, very often after all those years, your spouse or your partner is not the person that they were before. Yeah. You might not have the same capacities. But the issue is that, and especially for women, and I'm stressing women because of what we're doing today, but it's also for men, is that with science and with doctors and so on, we live in really, really healthy. I mean, I hope you don't mind. We have survivors in all forms. Yeah. <laughs> People are surviving all kinds of challenges. And that 30 years for your third act are years that can be extremely productive. Yeah. You can create a lot of value because you did a lot in the second act. You created value for your employers, for your family, for your communities. And what we at Connect Life Coaching are saying is, listen, going into the third act, you are facing fear, you're facing yeah. uncertainty. The thing you have to do is recreate. Find out the very thing that made you a star in the second act. What you need to do is reconfigure it, reshape it, and find a way to deal with the three fears. I tell you. So, what we're gonna do at this stage is share with you some ideas what you can do in preparation in that transition from either the workplace, moving into your own business, or being at home. What can you do to make your life a happy one, an energetic one, a prosperous one, you know, to live the type of life you would love to live. So what we're going to share, if anybody at this stage have any questions before we move into some of the solutions that you'd like us to come up, you okay? All right, so what can we do? And this is what Connections 50 Plus programs and events are all about. Because we know there are people who will say, listen, I don't want to do anything when I reach that stage. I just want to relax. But you may want social events to go to because you want to meet other persons, other mind like minded persons like yourself. That was in the contract. Yes. So at that stage, what we do, we provide a social platform for people to come together to have this conversation, to discuss, to dance, to have fun. Karaoke. Yeah. So when you reach that stage, when we home say, I am too lonely, I have nowhere to go, 
and you know I have nobody to go with. You make that form. We facilitate meeting new friends. And that's one of the solutions to help with that loneliness, to help with that feeling like you're not needed anymore. You know? And we want to go into okay. another area where we the help. next big M money. Because yes, you may have a pension, yes, you may have opportunity, or if you were severed suddenly, that, that three months might do nothing for you. But we recognize that we're going to what is people call it the gig economy, um, the world of social media and so on. And we recognize that we all have talents. And what Connections 50 Plus is doing is helping people to recognize the talents that they have and helping them to monetize it. Now, it won't replace your salary, but it will help to create activity. And what you can do, Jennifer is a certified life coach. I am a business consultant with years of business experience. We are actually working with people to help them create and run businesses. Now, not businesses that will take up your whole life and your whole time you're working again, but something to encourage life. There are about three groups we're working with now, and what the businesses help people to do also is also work with the friends. <laughs> yeah. So you start up, so you get to be active, and while you're active and getting to do what you love to do. And I'm sure if we had more time and I go around the room and I ask questions, someone will tell me they go at cooking, they go at sewing, they go at just, you know, speaking to other people, and you can get involved in doing the things and monetizing those skills. So at the end of the day, health comes with connections. If you lose your connectedness, you're gone. Yeah. The other thing too, we have to look at, we are providing knowledge. So on the Connections 50 Plus, we are actually, we do have podcasts, so we are having monthly podcasts on different areas. It's going to be persons could just interact with us, and we will help them with all the issues and fears that they will have. We also will have other professionals on board. So in many areas, especially the health area, we do work with a health coach who would be also on board to give tips. So we are not just, it's, we have that free, and that's free, okay? The uh, other programs that we will have, actually, and we have, and we encourage you to go on our website. We do have the, the handouts, we do have files with all the information on that website. We actually have a 12-month program mm -hmm. already created. So when you go on the website, and the website will, is Connect Coaching, see when you see connectcoaching.com, you will have that program. Plus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And on that program, you can decide which event you want to come to, what is it, you know, what is what you really, really going to be interested in, and it varies. All right? And of course, based on your request, we're going to be adding in different type of programs onto that. Yeah, so at the end of the day, Connections 50 Plus is really about making sure that we are ready to take that third act. The third act is not to be faced with fear because we are people of such tremendous value and connect coaching programs. Once you go online and you see it, we will certainly help you deal with the fear of the money. Oh yes. <laughs> with coping with the issue of health and your well-being and the most important, your community, your society, having fun. So at this stage, we want to thank you. Please come by, we will be here for a little while again to chat, have a flyer, and we wish you all a happy, healthy, prosperous, energetic 50 plus life. Thank you. Thank you very much.